Wow, look at we this. We need it, yes. please, with us on the desk. Very much quantity, not quality today, <laughs> isn't it? Dan Thomas, host of ESPN FC, to talk about this picture. Quality and quantity is what I like to say. Well, interesting, when you take a look at the two teams, one is very much not expected to be in the final, right. lacking that sort of quality that you would think would get you to a Champions League final. Borussia Dortmund have upset all the odds on the way, but they got a nice draw. They got a soft draw. They didn't really have to come up against any giants. It just so happens they're up against the giant in the final, Real Madrid, the most successful team ever in the history of the Champions League. All right, so take that and let's apply it to finding an edge here. Is yeah. it as simple as Madrid on the three-way line? Oh, no, it's really, you're not getting any value there whatsoever. So you take a look at it and you've got to go Real Madrid. So where am I finding any sort of value? So I look at, say, the three-way handicap. Give Real Madrid a minus one start. Will they win by two goals? Yes. Yeah, I reckon they will do. So there gives you a little bit of value as well. And what about half-time, full-time? If they're winning at half-time, winning at full-time, then you get a little bit of value there as well. You at least double your money. So you look at that, and just because they're so dominant and they're so good, and they've been there, done that before. It just means they have that experience, which I mean, think right from the start. Wembley's a big pitch as well. This is in London. Gives them a lot of space to work against a Borussia Dortmund side. Who, let's not forget, in the semi-final, PSG hit the post four times Ooh. against them. They don't really, well, they, they obviously deserve to be here on merit, but they've kind of had a bit of a lucky break along the way, and you feel their luck will run out this weekend. Sounds like the Rangers in hockey. I'm sorry, <laughs> I just can't get over the luck box, <laughs> Rangers. Please continue. How about in the player prop market? What's the storyline we should all be looking for? Should we go fairy tale? Yeah. <laughs> so you look at Venetius Jr., you look at Jude Bellingham, obviously they're favourites to the score any time during the game. But that's too easy. Yeah. If you go for someone like Tony Cruz, it's his last ever game for Real Madrid. He's going to retire at the end of the Euros, playing for Germany. And he has been a legend of the game throughout. And what a send-off it would be if he scores in the Champions League final before hanging up his Real Madrid shirt. Yeah, plus 550 anytime, 12 to 1 first goal scorer there, there you for go. Tony Cruz. All right, before we do get you out of here, Dan, and we allotted more time for this reason. Really? Normally it's 10 seconds, in and out, <laughs> socket, right, done that, tick that box. Compare for fans of American football how big the stage will be for these athletes and the betters who are watching and gambling on this brand of football. Well, this is it, isn't it? You know, obviously you would say this is kind of the soccer equivalent to the Super Bowl, yeah. but more people are watching than the Super uh, Bowl right. because more, more people care about <laughs> soccer worldwide than your football, <laughs> whenever that does. Uh, we're talking four, 450 million wow. people will be, be watching that final. And obviously it would be more if maybe the opponent yeah. was different to Borussia Dortmund, but still it draws eyes from all over the world. It is the pinnacle in a Europe European soccer, and it should be a fun final to watch. I think you've earned some more time on this desk around here with us. Come you're on, always welcome like, here. You know that. No, no. I always feel like I want it. It's like doing the dishes. Do it badly, and you never get invited back. I don't get paid more to come here, do I? It's just close to makeup. It's convenient. <laughs> well, it's convenient and fun when we have Dan Thomas around. Thanks, Dan. Appreciate it. No worries.